uh, <laughs> you know, it, it would have been a, a completely a different situation, wouldn't it? Yeah. <laughs> now, on July 31st of uh, 2015, there was a picture in a Rotarian newsletter. Yeah. Mm-hmm. The same day that you issued a protection order where the petitioner didn't sign it. No. Mm-mm. You say that you attempted two attempts of service on myself. Pooh. And then uh, the thought was, we're going to let Mike travel all over the world to all these different nations. Yes. Knowing uh, any fraud, forgery, kidnapping, abuse of power. Mm-hmm. Because we as police departments don't have an obligation to protect other nations. <laughs> Now, there could be a very large lawsuit in this. Yes. Where I could sue you for knowingly allowing for any person to travel outside of the United States when you have the evidence of a crime. Boom. One of those hundred billion dollar lawsuits where I go through every nation of the world that has any knowledge of this. Ah! And I sue them mm-hmm. for knowingly allowing Mike Van Proyen to leave the United States. Ah! Because the United States refuses to enforce the laws. Yes. Now, since July 31st of 2015, Rotary mm-hmm. published a newsletter mm-hmm. where my sister Susan Bowers is holding Legina. Ouch! And in the last four years, yes, five months and 17 days, mm-hmm. you allowed for Mike to travel all over the world. Mm-hmm. Now, I'm going to need to know in every nation of the world, yes, where Mike said, well, it's a practical joke. <laughs> But I don't think it's a practical joke. I think that Mike intentionally wanted to terrorize myself and Marilyn and her kids. Yes. Now, for every day that you let Mike go any place outside of the United States of America, I'm going to sue the four nations that have any videos or emails that have documented the fraud of using an image of Susan Bowers. So we're going to go through every nation of the world that Mike was able to travel to because he's getting 